Hi, welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2019 69 Reg G2330 EM Sport. Cars presented in Portimao Blue features the YNC body enhancement kit alongside some nice features and options. With all of our vehicles, they are physically in stock and are ready to be driven away. And if you would like to know more, please go ahead and use the links that are available in the description box. But let's get into talking about this G23 series. So we've added brand new 20 inch alloy wheels with the four brand new tires. Also included is the front splitter, matching gloss black kidney grills and side sill extensions, YNC and performance decals, aero mirrors, rear spoiler and the quad exhaust diffuser. We're going to come on to talk about the hybrid capabilities very, very shortly. You have also got rear privacy glass and we will, of course, show you through the interior in just one or two moments. So, as I mentioned, we have added one of our quad exhaust diffusers to this vehicle. It is a bolt-on piece, so the original exhaust system hasn't been interfered with, but these have been really popular since we've introduced these. The diffuser light in the middle is wired and does work exactly how it should do. You've got those lovely 3D rear lights, front and rear sensors with a reversing camera. Nice big boot space. It's the only area of a E-Drive that differs to a regular petrol or diesel model. You've got that slight compromise in space just due to, of course, the batteries being stored underneath there. This is the provided charging cable, so that's nice and simple. It's just a regular household three-pin socket. And again, we'll show you more about that in a moment. You've got folding rear seats. So again, makes up for that little bit of boot depth loss there. Charge time takes around about three to four hours if you have to use the more conventional three pin socket household way of doing so. But again, fast chargers can easily and very, very accessibly be installed at your home now. So again, that will significantly reduce that charge time. This is where you'll plug the charger in. So again, you can see how easy they've made it for you. When the battery is, batteries are fully charged, you, BMW give you a claimed range of around about 37 to 40 miles of electric range. You can see for yourself now, you've still got a very comfortable, very spacious interior, including a 4.3 seat Isofix rear bench. You've got heated front seats. You've got ambient lighting, which is of course customizable. You still get features like heated front seats. And we'll go on and get a chance to show you a few more of the interior features and functions in a bit more detail now. Beginning with the multi-function M Sport steering wheel then. So you've got cruise control, speed limiter, voice and volume functions. Paddles up here for the sports auto gearbox. Professional nav and media, which is all now touchscreen, which makes things really nice and simple to use. As you can see, it's going to give you points of interest, including charging stations and whether they are relevant for the car to be used and plenty more information on those. The home screen itself is fully customizable, which again makes things convenient for you. You can swipe across effortlessly between those different customizable widgets. This car has covered just over 58,000 miles. In terms of multimedia, you've got functions like DAB, Spotify, music collection, Bluetooth lining. You have also got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. If we go in and check the service status, the car isn't due a service for 20,000 miles. Service history wise, as you can see, it's got fantastic service history all with BMW. It's just been to BMW for an oil service, which is fantastic news for you as the potential next owner, meaning that you've got asphalt free motoring for 20,000 miles, you've got nothing to pay for 20,000 miles except popping a little bit of fuel in it and charging the car up, which is of course really nice to know that. The application side of things, again, we've covered the Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, but there are a bunch of other useful apps for the electric side of this car, eDrive Zone, BMW charging app. You've even got an M lap timer there, Alexa voice control, rear facing camera, and then down here, you've got your selectable modes, including sport, hybrid, and electric. So if you would like to know more on this fantastic E-Drive E20-330E, go ahead and use the links that are available just below in the description box. For the meantime, thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.